Welcome in the Sunday Sermon where we uh, read from the United Independent Compensatory Code System concept. Um, it's a compensatory counter-racist code by Mr. Neely Fuller Jr. Uh, this week we're reading from the uh, 2016 revised edition or revised and expanded edition of the compensatory code. Now this is a textbook workbook for thought, speech, and or action for victims of racism, white supremacy. Now if you're not a victim of racist white supremacy, then this is not the tome for you, right? Now, if you go to producejustice.com, you, 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 this book is available as well as a thing called a word guide. And uh, there's a, the, the original uh, 1984 edition is also available. So just in case you're interested in those publications. Now this, this is a Sunday sermon. Now, when we do Sunday sermons, we usually just take one, well, we take a page. Now, there are uh, nine areas of uh, people activity, as Mr. Neely Fuller Jr. Would, uh, would want to tell you. And uh, uh, we, well, we're, we're going to deal with uh, the area uh, of sex today. Um, now, there are the nine areas of ec uh, economics, education, entertainment, labor law, politics, religion, sex, and war, counter war. Now, Mr. Neely Fuller Jr. comes your comes our transmission every Tuesday um, uh, from like nine uh, Eastern Standard Time from nine to eleven, and he does not deal with the area of of, of war. I'll just to let you know, uh, but we're going to deal. With, um, well. That's it. So the, uh, the 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 page we're going to deal with is uh, page three forty today, and oops, and the way the book is laid out, you know, you have in bold, you have questions, and then the answers are, are given in a, a lighter type. Now we're going to do the well, the first two on these. The, the, this is a little bit. This is a, a uh, a little bit longer answer. The second one has a short answer. So we're going to do it both today. Okay, here we go. Every eight sex. If you decide that it's best to be married, married is in uh, quotes, within the system of white supremacy than to engage in sexual intercourse without being married, then do not under any circumstance complain about anything that your care mate, that's in quotes, says or does during the marriage. Oh, let's read that question again. If you decide that it is best to be married within the system of white supremacy than to engage in sexual intercourse without being married, then do not under any circumstance complain about anything that your care mate says or does during the marriage. And his explanation is, According to compensatory counter-racist logic, the only logical reason, that's in quotes, for non-white persons to marry during the existence of white supremacy is to eliminate all complaints and all conflict between persons involved in the marriage while working to replace racism and justice. Okay, this should be clear to you. Okay. And the uh, second question that we're going to address today is, is it correct to work hard, that's in quotes, is it correct to work hard to make a marriage, quotes again, work? Answer, A, quote, marriage that requires hard work to make it work is not a marriage. Hey, Mr. Neely Fuller Jr. rests his case there, and so do I. I'm being T from the Pattersons, taking the train to Tibet, letting you know what I only suspect from the uh, United Independent Compensatory Code System Concept, book by Mr. Neely Fuller Jr. 